Hi guys, it is my 31 week pregnancy update. We are in the single digits. What? Nine weeks left. I cannot believe it. I'm getting so excited. Um, my vivid dreams have come on like crazy. It's like you're going to have a human in the house that you have to take care of soon. There's a human in your body. Crazy. Um, so there hasn't been a lot going on. I have still been concentrating on my gestational diabetes um, diet and I've been doing really good. Um, I I think since like the past seven days I've had three high values. So that would be what? Seven times four. So out of 28 blood tests, only three were high. So I've been doing really good with that. I might have to have a cheat day soon and have some blueberry pancakes or something, I'm not sure. The walks are helping, the diet's helping, and the baby should be happy and healthy in there. Um, so she has been moving around like crazy. She is breached, her head's up here. Um, like two days ago, she <laughs> was telling my husband she's making money moves. Like I was laying in bed, maybe she flipped over, but my stomach was like <laughs> from side to side like twice, it was crazy. And now it's like, I feel like one side has got more going on on this side than the left side. So I don't know if like her butt's over here or her back or something, but that's pretty crazy. Uh, but speaking of dreams, so my husband, what app was it? I think it's the Ovia app. I woke up and he was getting ready for work and it was um, it was said like your husband can have vivid dreams from the anxiety, anticipation of having a baby. So I asked him and he was like, no. And he was like, oh, wait. And he was like, that's so weird. Last night he remembered his dream from the night before. But he did say his all of his dreams, he remembers them more than before. And I was like, those, it's because they're vivid. <laughs> So he's been having vivid dreams, but the funny thing was this, when I asked him that, he said that he had a dream that I had to go to work and he had to take the baby with him into work and um, he had meetings to go to, so he left her in the office and he had no clue how to feed her and I didn't tell him how to feed her and he was like stressed out, he didn't know how to feed his daughter. Um, so I thought that was really cute. So the bump is getting so big, I had to give up my side panel jeans, um, which I have like three pair. I love the ones from Target, the Ingrid and Isabella or whatever they are. But my bump is so big, they just fall down. And whenever I wear them, I look like an idiot. I'm constantly like lugging up my jeans. So I ordered a bunch of these full panel jeans, which I'm wearing one now. These are the only pair I have, so I need to get more of those. And the other funny thing with the bump that I've noticed, like when my husband leaves for work, I'm giving him like the Duggar side hug. <laughs> like it's not that easy to do a front full hug anymore. And if I do, I have to like lean my butt back. So now we do like the Duggar side hug, bye and hello. <laughs> As if we're like courting. The nursery is almost complete. We, um... I cannot find a reason a reasonably priced chair. That's like the last thing I need and I know some of them are can take some time to ship. The one I wanted was from Toys R Us and I went into the store, they're having the liquidation sale or Babies R Us. They're having the liquidation sale that going out of business and they were like, "Oh, well we can't sell the furniture from the store and um, we can't sell you like the models. Like they haven't given us permission." So I went online and they shut down the website. So I really want like the Sutton swivel chair, I think it's called. And I've been looking online, like Pottery Barn has a similar one and it's like twice the price, which is a no-go. So I'm hoping soon that I just luck out, go into a Baby's R Us and they are able to sell me the model on the floor. If not, um, I have found some at Wayfair and others like that, but this one is like a wing back chair and it's so pretty. So, and I haven't been able to find anyone else who carries it, I'm so bummed. But so that is, I think the last big purchase for the nursery and then the nursery is done and hopefully I can film a nursery tour soon. So that's gonna be it for 31 weeks. I will show you my bump. <laughs> There's the bump. She's like more on this side 
than this side. Right? I love my little bump. I think it's so cute. Thank you so much for watching, and if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe right here. And if you want to check out my 30 week update, you can do that here. And then if you want to see all of my stroller up a baby dreams come true, here is the review of my beautiful stroller that I got that I absolutely love. So I will see you guys next week on my 32 week update. Bye.